Eric, would you do Osman and Kevin Love for Tobias Harris? I mean, I might do that. I mean, you get. I mean, I, I, I might do that. I think Kevin has won a championship and played a major role and had a way uh, much better season than people anticipated. Um, you can get a guy that has started at three. Um, I might do that. And, and, and Kevin can also be your backup five. Yeah, he can. Yeah. I mean, I think he played, he played 74 games last year, right? Very, yeah. very health, very, very healthy for him, but he only averaged 22 minutes a game last year. So they were really smart in how they how they worked him out. Like, you know, if we play you less, we could play you more. So um, I think with us, we probably need to go up a little bit. I wouldn't want to do too much. I don't want him to get injured. But, I mean, yeah, it, it, I think, yeah, I think Love would fit in pretty well. He, on off nights for Embiid, he could play small ball five. Uh, he's a good stretch I mean, four. I, I would do it, and then, but it has to be more beneficial from a cap space, either in the future or – or presently, I think the cap hit as far as going forward would have to be better. It couldn't be worse. Yeah. Um, so Love makes 28. He makes about 10 less than Joe Bias. But the beauty of Love is it's it's his last year. So if yeah. we wanted to clear that out and be like, all right, this didn't work, um, we can do that. And Austin makes like six or seven. His contract's pretty, pretty reasonable, actually. So if you were doing this, it'd be like, okay, you know, if it doesn't work, then, you know, we get $28 million off our cap next year. And then, you know, um, again, that would also depend on what they want to do with Harden and whatnot. But they can still fill out other positions on there. They could still get that Portis type, and you could split minutes with Portis and Love, which would be pretty good at your four. Yeah, I get it. What Would Seti star at three? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, in that deal, I didn't even see Thibel. So you go, you, you go Osman and Thibel at three switching off. That's pretty good offense defense. Yeah. I mean, that's a good shooter. Not sexy names in that trade, but I mean, I, I, as you guys yeah. said, that it, it, it makes sense on, on, on that lineup. Yeah. But. It's kind of like a bizarre version of that Dallas trade, really, except you're not getting two of those guys. Yeah. Um, you're getting like two wings and like a, a, a real poor man's version of what love is with Bertans. Mm -hmm. like, I mean, so it's a, uh, it's close to that, but you're getting two better wings than Osman, but you're also getting a worse four with Breton. So it's like, pick your poison. What do you want to have a worse four or worse wings? It's like, yeah. you know, I guess see who's more available in free agency.